Hello guys! What up people? Welcome to a new episode here in the Philippines. I'm Justin. I'm Alina and today amazing weather. <laughs> yes, today amazing weather. That's why... No, it's not really that, but we're making scenic guys today. <laughs> So now we're heading to our favorite market, Landmark, and today we actually have a friend joining us as well, and our friend is called Joy, Yeah. and she is actually a Filipina, and she can speak Russian as well. Yeah, because her husband is Russian, that's yeah. how we meet, and it's really crazy. Later we will uh, introduce her to yeah. you guys, especially because the first time Alina told me, like, some Filipina girl actually messaged me in Russian, I was like, whoa. Really? Yeah. And then we hang out with her last time at Chinatown. I'm not sure if you guys remember her, mm -hmm. but I will guys uh, show you guys. Uh, so she will be teaching us how to cook sinigang Yeah, I'm so excited to cook sinigang. This is my favorite dish in the Philippines. Yep, my favorite soup in the world, pretty much. <laughs> Who would have thought like a sour soup would be something that oh, I like a lot? Right. Anyway, now we're heading to the market. We might need to grab a cup of coffee first because we're still a bit half asleep, I think. <laughs> so let's have a go to the market and grab a cup of coffee and then we go shopping. Okay. Okay, let's, let's go. go. Hi. Hello. Hi, John. Hello. Hello. Nice haircut. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I saw the video. Oh, you saw it the whole world? <laughs> so this is Joy, and uh, she will be our, our teacher today. Yeah, Joy, say hi to our audience. Say something in Filipino language. Hello. English. <laughs> 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 Privet in Russian. Uh, she speaks uh, full, uh, Russian fluently too. Yeah. <laughs> better than me. Much better than me. Okay, let's do, uh, grab our ingredients then. Yeah. Right, okay. So what do we need for sinigang? Okay. Since we are in vegetable area, yes. you choose what kind of vegetable you want. Okay. Sinigang. Oh, really? Any? Yeah. So not really any, but usually it's uh, this radish. Mm. Check the price oh, I love radish. Mm -hmm. yeah, this is the cheapest. Wow. It's the eight. It's like a hand. How much? How many we need? <laughs> one only. This is already too much. Uh, it's okay for three of us because we will put other vegetables as well. Oh, okay. So yeah. mm -hmm. radish and then we call Chinese uh, spinach kangkong. Mm -hmm. Kangkong. 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 I never heard of that. Kangkong. Kangkong. Yes. Kangkong. <laughs> okay. Right. I don't know about this veggie. Yeah, I'm me Chinese. too. Maybe today we learn something new about like uh, Filipino veggie. Let's buy ingredients and later we will show you guys what we what grab we in this market. Okay. Tomato. Radish. Kangkong. Yeah. Kangkong. <laughs> Alright, so the music stopped now, so now we can finally vlog. Oh, the music's back? Oh no. Um, okay, we already grabbed uh, many ingredients. Um, so, this is, hmm, what is this called again? Sitao. Uh, Sitao. Yeah, it's like some sort of beans. string beans, right. Yeah. And we've got Kang Kong here as a plane just then, and we've got powder the Sinigang powder. And, uh, Joy actually said for pork, it's better to use like taro. Uh, flavored sinigangs, but if um, it's like seafood, then there is not a pack for this as well. Mm -hmm. Gabi, isn't it like good night or something? Yes. <laughs> no, no, no. Gabi, Gabi night. Is the root of the Tagalog for taro. Oh, I see, I see. Uh, there is a difference in stress. Gabi and Gabi. Oh, Gabi this and Gabi. Taro is a Gabi, and then Gabi is evil. Wow, sounds like Russian again. Like, <laughs> when tells me this, like when I pronounce her name. One time, two times, she's like, no! But I was like, I pronounce exactly the same as what she said. <laughs> Gabi, Gabi, Gabi! Yeah. Gabi! Gabi! And this one, reddish. Yep, reddish. Oh, and this one, I'm first time, first time see this it's one. It's very common though, eggplant is really? everywhere. Yeah. I know, hey, we fish, got sauces. So, you know, I'm a king of sauces. I what like What kind sauces. of fish it is? <laughs> no, just fish sauce, usually for fried rice. Okay. And also we grab this is pork belly and some beef. Yeah, because I know for Sinigang usually we uh, people use pork belly, but for us, I know when we go to restaurants, we like to eat the meat in the soup. That's how we got some extra chunks of meat that we can like actually eat later. 
How do you have uh, sesame oil? At oh, house? we just went out. Yeah. We just went uh, out. We can buy small because, for example, this is string beans. Yeah. Um, the way I cook, usually I cook um, two types of uh, dishes. Mm. For example, I have this. Maybe I can use half of it and then half will be like stir fry string beans. Oh, okay. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. for another meal. Oh, together with veggie will be. Yes. I think we can buy sashimi oil, like big pack, because Justin always needs it. I always oh, really? use it yeah. Yeah, all the time. Like yeah, I uh, can. Yeah, something like this would be nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, they've got two. Awesome. Pack Which one? Two. This, this one? No. Uh, oh, yeah, that's the uh, same no. too. This that's sashimi oil. This is macaroni. This yeah. one then. Mm. And this comes with two packs. That's good. Hey, what else? Let's, let's do a scene of happy shopping. <laughs> <laughs> again, again, again. Okay, and this one. Chili pepper, I don't like it, but we need it for Sinigan. <laughs> yeah, it is what it is. I think, uh, yeah, sometimes we don't like it. Like, say, like onions, I don't like it. But sometimes it does give out the flavor that the dish additionally needs. Yeah. So, oh, this is fuko. Yeah. You need coconut too. Coconut? For hydration. Oh. <laughs> Instead of buying water. <laughs> for me, it's for me. <laughs> okay, okay. Right, buko, buko. This is the this is the tamarind. I mean, ah. It's available here. And like uh, Alina said, tamarind is not something common in your country. I don't yes. know what is this. I even wow. don't know taste tamarind. Are you? <laughs> this is like a sour taste, right? Yeah, yes. super sour ah. taste. It's wood. You said it's wood powder. Is it? Had in this package, it's already powdered, but ah. it's it's really a, a fruit. Fruits. Yeah, right. it's uh, yeah. Uh, interesting. Okay. Yeah. I will ask Huya if they have. Um, it's better to cook using the real uh, mm. tamarind or sampano. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah, but I think we can use it later. Better yeah. to use this because it's fast and um, how to say the taste. It's like um, when you put it, it's immediately sinigang. Oh. Oh. I see. Yeah. Right, right, right. But this one, you need to boil it for five minutes, and then when it's soft, you just use fork, fork to mash it. it. Yeah, mash right. it. Right. Yeah. Uh, but we need this. Okay. What is this? Gabi. Taro. Oh, Gabi. Gabi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. So now we've got all our ingredients here for Sinigang, and we're gonna bring this home, and I'll see you guys at home. All right. Let's go. All right, okay, so guys. we're back at home now. We've got all these ingredients on the table. So we're gonna go for the ingredients one by one, just to tell you what we've got. So let's start with that one first. Okay, first, what do you need for cooked sinigang? It's a uh, eggplants. Yes, green pepper. Also, we need this is radish mm -hmm. and tomato. Uh, we take some like um, Filipino tomatoes, like many here, but usually we need red for soup sinigang. And one thing that we notice tomatoes in the Philippines is that usually I think it's very different taste compared to other countries tomatoes. But uh, I think uh, tomatoes this time we're just going to use for soup, so we doesn't actually have to eat the tomato, so it's okay. The flavor is going to be in soup. Yeah, anyway sinigang will be like so sour. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anyway it's going to cover all the, all the taste. Okay, next this is it's uh, the essence. most important part. It's a powder. Yeah. Powder with Tamarind. Gabi and Gabi. And Gabi. Yeah, the taro flavor. Oh, and also we have Gabi. Yeah, also Gabi. <laughs> Many Gabi. Yeah. Yeah, it's better. Next, we just got onions. Three onions. Is it Luke? Is it Luke? Luke, yeah, yeah. In right. Russian, Luke. <laughs> In Filipino, how it's called? Just Sibuyas. Sibuyas. Sibuya. Oh, it's like Sibu. Oh, Sibuya. Okay. Shibuya. Japan. Japan. <laughs> Sibuya. Sibuya and uh, fish. Sauce, yeah, yes. fish sauce. And oh, so we've got sesame oil over here as well later. And we've got King, King Kong? Kong. Ka Kang Kong. Yeah, <laughs> Kang Kong. <laughs> and uh, we've got the Sid Tao here, which is beans. String beans. String beans. Yeah. I don't think I've actually had this before. You usually eat this in Sinigang, remember? I, I remember. Yeah, it's so tasty. Okay, maybe I, I, maybe I haven't had this before. And this is Two the... cups of meat. We've got two cups of meat. Yeah, this is more beef. And this is pot belly. Yeah. Okay. Let's start cooking. All right. Let's start cooking. I'm so hungry already. So. <laughs> All right. Let's do it. And apparently, sinigang is gonna take an hour and a half. Mm -hmm. So it's gonna take a while. So maybe I should eat. Some <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, let's get started. To remember how to cook sinigang. Okay. Not, not just like a um, random ingredients. Yeah. So you have you have the main the main sauce. 
the meat and then the vegetables. Mm -hmm. yeah. And actually, so this is the vegetable and this one is actually for sauce only. We oh. won't use this yet. Okay, right, So right. we have three parts, right? So it's easy to, to remember. Okay. Repeat again, I'm a bit goldfish. fish. So this one is for soup, the flavors. Yeah. This one is it's meat. meat. And yep. then this this will be like our base. Okay, I yeah. see. And then the, the, the meat and then the vegetables. Because vegetable you just only put it when it's done. Except for taro. Because taro is really hard. Uh, ah, yeah. I see, I see. I actually don't know how to cook taro. So I don't know how I'm going to cut it. So be our teacher today. Yeah. All right, how are we going to do this? What we we'll start first? Uh, cut uh, onions, um, tomatoes, and then uh, we can pre-boil ah, okay. the, the meat to yep. remove the, 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 uh, the impurities yes. before it. Yeah. Okay, yes. yeah, let's do it. Okay. So let's boil the water first and cut the ingredients. How many days can this soup last for? <laughs> the the semigang? Yeah. Only yeah. <laughs> maybe two days, mm. which okay. Well, that's the one day. <laughs> yeah, I eat a lot. Usually, I mean, I cook like four chicken or something. But it's all from one chicken though. So one big chicken fillet, she kind of four slices. But uh -huh. then when she cooked four, we expect to cook for, uh, eat for another day. But anyway, I eat all of them. Yeah, uh, in Russian style, we always like try to save food for next few days for all family. But Justin eat all of them. But, but, but uh, why, why you get that? Uh, that's insane food. <laughs> <laughs> I eat a lot. <laughs> yeah, I eat a lot. I eat a lot. You know. I think uh, in, in Russia, uh, Alina told me they uh, normally eat this portions like like this, not a lot. Yeah, mm -hmm. like this. Like fist, Size like, like fist. our fist. fist. Mm -hmm. and, uh, actually, because in Russia you have soup, uh, you have salad, you have soup, and you have uh, rice as well or something. Yeah. And meat, right? So it's three parts. Yeah. Yeah. So you don't have to eat all of it because it, you have, like in, for example, in Asia, Korean, Japanese, mm -hmm. like you have small parts and you are ready for mm -hmm. mm -hmm. True. I think the entree. What do you call that? The the Korean. Which one? The stuff. The stuff is panchan. 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 <laughs> and another dish size, so three dishes like this. Oh my god. And we finish everything. Yeah, wow! Why Jackson was never with friends before. I wasn't bad. <laughs> was normal size, normal size. <laughs> yeah, that's normal size. Okay. Okay, wash the ingredients first, I guess. Uh, oh, we need rice as well. Huh? We need yes. rice? Oh, yes, we need rice. Filipinos need rice. Yeah, yeah everything goes with rice. <laughs> yeah. Even, even soup goes with rice. Well, yes. <laughs> uh, unlike in Russia, when you have soup, only soup. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because you put many potato inside, you put many ah, yeah, inside. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that's why it's so filling. Yeah. We, we usually use potato for yes. everything. <laughs> yeah, but the thing here is that they, uh, my Filipino friends and Russian friends, they said that potato in Philippines and Russia is very different. In Russia, it's very flavorful. Maybe because of the soil. I don't know, I don't feel different between potato and it's no different with rice because here potato is crazy. <laughs> it's very expensive. It's so expensive. Maybe they are, but just not yeah. many, many. And like, uh, we don't have like a potato salad. I mean, mm, we, right. they only cook it during maybe their, their celebration. Right, let's see. I cooked uh, two bowls of rice this time, two cups of rice. Uh -huh. Because yesterday I finished one cup myself. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay, we eat a lot here. Okay, how do I need to cut onion? Mm. Maybe, you know, I, I read the other day that mm. on the internet, they say if you cut, cut the, this thing here, then you start crying. Yeah, I always <laughs> cry when I cut. But if you don't cut this part, it's wet. Unless until the end, yeah. Uh. Then you oh, won't cry. I always cry when I cry. Yeah, that's why yeah. when I cut, I, I never cry. <laughs> yeah. Let me try. How, how like square or ring? Like this. And do you guys wash rice before you cook? Asian need to wash rice. Yes. And do you use like finger to measure water? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, they say yeah, like first joint is how much you need to add water for. It's like I don't know if you guys watch the channel, but Uncle Roger. 
Yeah. Uh, there's this Asian guy who rants about everything. Basically, he said, joint, first joint. That's how much water you need. <laughs> okay, life hack from Justin today. Yes. Finger, finger. <laughs> Yeah. So you can have the onion like this. Mm -hmm. It's so funny because originally we tried to buy uh, buy whole pack of rice, mm -hmm. and then suddenly the next day the Tagib government sent us another pack of rice. and like, oh, that's gonna last us for a year. We don't need to buy rice anymore. <laughs> when was that? Uh, it was Christmas. Ah, uh, really? I yeah, uh, when we moved there. Mm. Yeah, now we have a lot of rice. Yeah. One year, I guess. I think it will last longer than one year, so if anyone wants a free pack of rice, you can get us out. No, for you, it's maybe it's uh, in uh, more done, but for Filipinos... I remember for family of seven, the full sack of rice, which is 50 kilos, mm. it's for one month. Wow. Only. Wow. I can imagine, I guess. Last time I had Budo's fight, uh -huh. and there is so much rice, rice more than ingredients. So I can imagine, like, if that is for three people last time, a Budo fight, so <laughs> much rice. Oh, John, how often do you eat, like, Budo's fight? Um, less, actually. <laughs> really? Why? Uh, is it because it's more island? Um, it's an island thing, uh, so... No, not really. It's because I haven't been in a larger group since pandemic. Oh, yeah, because Google nice. Bite usually for a uh, larger group. Mm, right. Yeah. I, I heard it's for like team building. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so interesting experience. And you use your hands, right? Yeah. yeah. First time in my life eating with hands. Me too. Yeah. Oh. Really. I know like Indians, they yeah, do that, yeah. but I never went to India to actually eat uh -huh. this. So. And I saw at Mani Naso people do that too. Yes. And they eat with rice, more flavors maybe. Mani Naso they eat with Yeah, I saw. Yeah, like, chicken oil. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> sometimes if I really want to eat like a uh, so tasty uh, dishes and. Yeah, well, tasty dishes? Yes, and. I will use my hands, like I, I will excuse myself. Okay, I will excuse myself, I wash my hands and I will eat mm. with hands. But people will understand anyway, right? Yes. Because, yeah, I think all Filipino people, they like using their hands eating. Most people. Yeah. yeah. Not every time, but if they really like um, magana, like they want to eat a lot. Mm, then they use hands. Yes. Interesting, right? <laughs> And I can imagine with, with like sauces and everything, sometimes you want yeah. to like get all the sauce like on your hand. I mean, imagine eating sweet and sour pork Chinese in the <laughs> Finger looking good. It's like finger looking good. Oh, it's KFC. <laughs> uh, where is the garbage? We can currently don't have a garbage bin, so we're just using plastic bags for now. And wash and tomatoes. I, I saw many people, like many Filipino uh, YouTube, YouTube channels, they are uh, they like to save a lot of plastic bags. Like they grab some from supermarkets and they just like store it somewhere uh, in, inside a cabinet. When they open a cabinet, all the plastic bags fall out. It's like me, you can see I have many, many plastic yeah, we, bags there. You're squeezing everything there. Yeah. Alin, I understand you. In <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in Russia, usually we like use one plastic bag and we put inside many, many another plastic bag. Really? Yeah, in every Russian house, have plastic bags with plastic bags. For no, what? Why? 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 So for just like, I don't know, something if you need? No, oh, it's because the packet or plastic in Russia costs like 2 pesos or 5 pesos, yeah, right? Yeah, oh, so it costs quite a bit. Right. <laughs> we'll try to save and don't buy again. Right, so when you go to the market, you just take, <laughs> just take many. Yeah, or we just take one big, we have big, big, big plastic bags. <laughs> right, interesting. Okay. I re oh, I, re I remember in, in when we were in supermarket in Russia, mm -hmm. I was waiting in in front of the cashier and the cashier is looking at me was looking at me oh. and i was looking at her because why she didn't put my groceries in the bag oh. and then <laughs> cashier is looking at me why are you not taking your groceries <laughs> oh, you do it yourself yeah, man, Russia, right? always, so that's why when here oh. they start to packing my things i'm like oh what are you doing i need i need it <laughs> i just can't do it by myself when you're doing this <laughs> right. yeah <laughs> In Australia, they always pack things for you, I think. Ah, uh, really? Mm -hmm. Oh wait, no, they don't, because it's self-checkout. 
in Australia, uh, everything is self checkout now. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, I will wash this one. Oh, you need to wash the pot. Yes. Uh, I thought it's just like you chuck it in to boil. I thought. Ah uh, no, uh, we, we still we still wash it. Right. Yeah, I remember uh, reading comments in in the internet. They are arguing if meat should be what? washed or not. <laughs> because by cooking, you you kill the germ, the bacteria, right? Yeah. So see, guys, you always need to wash beef. To be honest, we never do this. Yeah, we never <laughs> do. So, yeah, but just need for kill bacteria. I think it's half half. My family never washed beef before. Sometimes my mom would wash chicken. Uh, I washed chicken yesterday. Yeah. I think I washed chicken and I dry it. I think chicken is okay. Yeah, you need, you need dry it most importantly. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not soup. Do you need to cover it? Or? Yeah, I think better to cover it. <laughs> but uh, I told you that I, I cook lazy now because I use instant pot and I just put everything there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So typically, Sydney gang should take a long, take longer. Yes. Mm -hmm. First yeah, so time learn how to cook sinigang. Yeah, first time learning. So I think after this experience, we can start making it at home and uh, maybe try more Filipino dishes. Exactly. Comment below what we need to cook next and we'll try to cook it at home. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel now, do it now because uh, you'll be seeing a lot more new vlogs coming up. I'm not sure if you, you, you guys know already, but we're going to Tagaysay very soon. And also, we're going to uh, El Nido and Koran and my family will be coming to the Philippines to visit me as well. So it's going to be really exciting. This is Gabi. <laughs> Gabi. Gabi, name so cute to be honest. Yeah. Maganda Gabi. <laughs> <laughs> right? It's the same? Maganda Gabi. Yeah, Maganda Gabi. And then this is Gabi. Like, Gabi. long Gabi. 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 Gabi is Gabi. night. Yes. Gabi. It's Gabi. Wow. <laughs> wow. It's like Cantonese. In uh -huh. Cantonese, there are like nine sounds of uh -huh. the same word. Uh -huh. Like ga 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 they all are different. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's hard. <laughs> I'm so hungry, I feel so 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 hungry, crazy hungry, I wanna eat. <laughs> me too. This will be my favorite thing guys, because we cook it by ourselves. Mm -hmm. Because I'm so hungry. <laughs> and this is Sinigan makes me more hungry. Yeah. Because it's sour. Uh, do you have sour soup in Russia as well? No, we don't have. We have sweet and sour. Uh, how about she? Ah, it's not, it's not super sour, it's just like cabbage. Mini uh, cabbage and sour. Ah, uh, uh, salyanka. Salyanka, maybe. I don't like salyanka. I don't like it. I love borscht. Aha, uh -huh, borscht. Yeah, you, you cook it for three days. No, uh, you cook it once and then you eat it for three days. Yeah. Right? <laughs> and second day and third day, it's more tasty. Yeah. Uh, by the way, borscht is a um, Russian soup, Russian-Ukrainian soup. Um, however, when I first cook it and then I let my family try it, mm -hmm. they said like it tasted like bulalo with uh, beetroot. Wow, really? Yeah. You know like, bulalo? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Bulalo. Yeah, beef broth and then you just put the, the vegetables. Mm -hmm. Interesting, but I, I, we never try, we never try bulalo, right? We just uh, hear about it. We we actually tried, but uh, oh, it's a right? sifu version of porchetta, which is bulalo. Ah, yes, I think it's a little bit different. When you try uh, Manila style bulalo, which we're going to take a soon, which is famous for uh, yes, bulalo. Yes. So we're gonna try that. <laughs> yeah, Russian porch. So many. If you guys didn't try, I recommend you. Yeah, usually when I cook, I cook so like everything everywhere. <laughs> After I cook, my kitchen is like so dirty. And usually, we have a rule with Justin. If I cook, Justin clean dish. If Justin cook, I clean dish. So usually. What do you mean? If I cook, I clean dish too. <laughs> if you cook, I clean dish too. That's the rule. You didn't hear this. <laughs> so after me, Justin needs clean all kitchens, like everywhere on the floor, like flower. Now, if I cook, Justin cleans. If I cook, Justin cleans. My perfect boyfriend. <laughs> So we'll cut the the gabi gabi yeah, into gabi. dices. And, and this one. Yeah. So some people just use the, the knife to cut it like this. Okay. Mm, I love it. This is so tasty. Yeah. Wait, same one? Yeah, same one. Um, but other Filipinos they just use this. Mm. Oh, it's hands like this. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, <laughs> probably it's a 
it's it's <laughs> hypnotizing actually like yeah it's some people like just do it like this when it stresses do yes <laughs> yeah i like this one don't need to cut <laughs> <laughs> wow so so um how do you call it like so soothing yeah <laughs> so relaxing hey when you when you cut when, oh, when you do when you open oh. all them yeah oh that's cool oh so you put, 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 uh, you put water, uh, I mean clean water. Yeah. Another one. Another water. Yeah. Wow. This whole thing is it's like cooking ramen. You just mm -hmm. like take the impurities from the meat, means like the dirty things from the meat, mm -hmm. and then take the throw away all the water, and then start boiling with the clean oh. meat. Yeah. Wow. Yes. You don't have to do this step, but I think it's just personal preference. Maybe maybe. Um, okay, I think all the veggies are done here. And what about the the sea towel? Uh, the sea towel we can we can use it all, but if you want to stir fry it, it's okay as well. Mm -hmm. In, in sesame oil. Oh yeah, that sounds nice. We boil the water. Yes. Yeah. Oh, looks good. Mm -hmm. See this? This is just because. Ah, the impurities. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Alright, so as you can see, the impurities on the side are there. Yep, so we're taking all that out so that our soup will be nice and clear later. And we're boiling new water to actually prepare for the Sydney Gang soup now. Mm -hmm. So it's, like, it's so it's first time in my life when I need like clean the pork. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh. Ah, wait. We don't cook pork in Russia. Right. I see. <laughs> why? Why is that? Um, because I was born in Muslim republic. Mm. So we usually don't eat pork. Right. We don't eat pork. So. I see. Russians. Many are Muslim. You're saying. Yeah. Oh, Maybe. interesting. I didn't know that. Mm. My mother never eat pork. My mother. I know, it's, we don't really believe in our traditions, we just like, like a habit, we just don't eat. But I've seen this like many times, like, you know, uh, filtering out the impurities in every ramen, because I really wanted to cook ramen, but I know ramen has many steps as well, something similar to this, but it takes maybe overnight to boil the soup. Yes. Usually I, I do like this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because we don't have a colander, that's why. <laughs> yeah, we don't have colander. Mm. Ah, maybe we can we can cook some of it in stir fry while we are okay. waiting. Yeah, sounds good. Mm -hmm. mm. Ah, not green. After fry. Half of it we will use in Okay, sounds good. Maybe this makes me hungry already. Yeah, me too. <laughs> okay, how would you cut this? Oh, can you do this again? Yeah, but it, it's it's long. <laughs> <laughs> and it's hard, so better cook. Remember, cook smart. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'll do it. Okay. Right. So this is we do for rice. Stir fry. Stir fry, yeah. This is already another dish. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, snack before the lunch. Yeah. Oh, I heard there is like a name for snacks in the Philippines. Merienda. Oh, merienda. Yeah. Yes. It's a. Uh, what, what what does that mean actually? It's like afternoon tea time or it's just snack time. No, it's a in between snack. So Filipinos usually they. Um, no, the, the early Filipinos, usually they wake up at early morning, uh, maybe 6 or 7 a.m. Yeah. And then at 10 a.m., when 6 to 7 a.m., they wake up, they do their work, and at 10 a.m., they rest under the tree, and they will have like shesta time, and they have merienda, the snacks in between, and then at 12, they will have lunch. Mm -hmm. After lunch, uh, they will rest, <laughs> a lot of rest. Mm -hmm. And they will have merienda again at 3 p.m. Wow. And then um, dinner will be like 6 to 7. Yeah. Yeah. In in province, they do they do that. 6 to 7 p.m. And then they sleep. 
<laughs> but in modern Filipino, uh, snacks is not not in between, but all the time. Any time. Yeah, any time. What do you usually stir fry, Justin? Just garlic. Garlic, salt, um, and sometimes we add oyster sauce. Uh -huh. No, um, I mean um, meat or oh, just uh, veggies. Just veggies. veggies. Yeah, what, yeah, what kind of veggies? Uh, so we, we do stir fry mix, yeah. So in, in this uh, Justin's household, we uh, <laughs> do uh, like spinach, broccoli, um, bok choy, ah, bok choy, just all kinds of veggie, really. Any uh -huh. veggie you come up with, just chuck it in, just put oil and stir uh -huh. fry. Yeah, but we don't add sesame oil. Ah, uh, really? Mm, don't uh -huh. we? We just, yeah. I think sesame oil would taste nice, really nice. So, I want to try this is Filipino tomato for 34 peso. How's it? Mm, to be honest, it's not bad how it, before I buy an it's not, it's really like no taste. And all. you just got the fat one then last time. Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm. Very expected. I like it. Wow. wow. <laughs> Why is this big difference? Some tomato is like 34 pesos, some tomato is 200. They imported. This is local. Mm. Uh, this is like uh, like from Baguio. Uh, no, I mean imported from other countries. Mm. Uh, this one is local. Some uh, some are Baguio, some are like mm. lowland mm. from different provinces. Mm. From, from Baguio, everything so tasty. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Fresh. Love, love Baguio. I'm gonna go to Baguio soon. Yeah, we were actually going to go to Baguio originally for the Panabanga uh, ah, mm. festival, but we just missed it. We couldn't get, we couldn't get a bus. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm. And this is a lot. Do you eat this raw? Can you eat raw? <laughs> <laughs> from now on, from now on, we cannot talk to Joy. We oh, cannot talk to Alina too. <laughs> Open them up. <laughs> I really love like raw, raw garlic. garlic. Yeah, Alina introduced me to raw, <laughs> raw garlic. It's so yeah. spicy though. Yeah, Justin never eats raw garlic, but in Russia we always eat raw garlic. It's yeah. a for immunity. Uh, Alina yeah. eats everything raw actually, <laughs> uh, not just garlic. Joy is so brave. <laughs> <laughs> just oh. Yeah. Ah, do you eat cabbage as well? Cabbage? Yeah, raw cabbage. Yeah, of course. Well, no, I, I don't eat like big cabbage like this. I uh. eat like a Chinese Pigeon cabbage. She eats uh. raw onion too. Oh yeah, I, I, ah, yeah, I like onion. Ah, see! <laughs> Look at darling! <laughs> okay, uh, we can put the um, tomatoes, onions, and uh, gabi in mm -hmm. silicone. So mm -hmm. while we are doing the stir fry, it's like multitasking. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Yeah, there are there are people who who put their, like how to say, spices in like a sequential, but I do it <laughs> all the time, like, put <laughs> it everything. That's good. Okay, just put everything inside. Tomato and onion. Mm -hmm. And else? And mm -hmm. gabi, because it's mm -hmm. long. I don't remember gabi in uh, Senegal when we eat in Manam. Ah, yeah, because so like, it's pork, pork or beef? Beef. Yeah. It's beef. It's, 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 it's uh, usually it's with pork. pork. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Looks so nice. Mm. Usually it's pork in right? Yes, with gummy. Seafood is not common. Seafood is in uh, it's, it's common as well. No, I've never had seafood in game actually. I can imagine it's is it because like ingredients would be more like expensive, that's why it's not as common. Or, mm. or still pretty common usually. It's still it's still common. In other res restaurants usually they have um, seafood sinigam. Um. And fish sinigam as well. Bangus. No bangus. Bangus fish. Yeah. Yes. It's the most popular type of fish. What are you doing? Stir fried veggie. Stir fried veggie. So first of all, we want to put the garlic in to get the flavors out of the garlic mm -hmm. until golden brown. Mm -hmm. And after that, we're going to chuck the uh, beans as well, the sitao. And after you put rice, top <laughs> of this. Huh? Top of this rice. No. No? No, just stir fry veggie. Ah. Uh, we, can, we can eat with rice. We're cooking rice here. Really <laughs> oh, it's done already. So fast. Mm. Yeah, so everything with rice, we've got veggie here, we've got soup. 
with rice. I think it's my first time eating soup with rice actually, so it's gonna be very interesting. <laughs> Why? You always eat sinigan with rice. Oh yeah, true. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but in the Philippines, I mean, like, in our country. Yeah, um, me too. First time eat soup with rice when I need put rice inside soup or just like mix mm, it. Yeah, I remember first time in Manam because Manam Sinigang is a little bit different. Manam yeah, Sinigang is like has a bit of sweetness in it because they add, it's fusion, they add watermelon uh -huh. inside instead of like a traditional sour agent. Mm -hmm. So usually you put rice inside Sinigang or you just like eat it like together? No, rice and then you put the soup, the, the dish uh, over. Ah. Yeah. You put soup to rice, like you take spoon rice and put soup. No. So you have rice uh -huh. here and then you have soup uh -huh. here, right? And then you put the, the soup and then the meat and then the vegetable. To rice. rice? Yes, to rice. Oh, oh wait, do we put, put these half of them in... Uh, uh, now, now we do it for soup, this one. Yes, this one's right, all of them. Ah, but usually, <laughs> usually we put rice to soup. Ah, but we don't put a lot. We just like take a spoon yeah. and eat together. Yeah, okay. Uh, Later I will show you. <laughs> okay. But, uh, it's, it's a preference. There's no right or wrong answer, right? Okay. Wait, when do you guys start seeing oil in the end? Or? Hey, yeah, at the end. So it's like a um, like taste. Mm. This one, I hope it's good size. And it's like hot sauce. Yeah, hot sauce. Can I try? Can I eat it slow? Try. It's okay, you eat everything raw anyway. <laughs> Your body is used to it. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Wait, I know what is this. I know what this it's is. It's a bean. Now. It's a bean. Yeah, it's string bean. Oh, it tastes good. Yeah, I know it's raw. <laughs> I'll eat in Russia raw. Huh? Yeah. This one raw? Yeah. Oh my god. But they right? Not <laughs> the Every country is so different. Rules. And like this. <laughs> like <laughs> <a> monster. <laughs> okay, coming up, son. Yeah. Oh. Cool. And then you can try it. This one, this one, see? Usually in Russia we take out this one and we eat this one. Ah, oh, really? Yeah. Mm. Let me just give a quick try. Try it. It's tasty. It's okay. Good. Look at this. You can smash the tomatoes. Ah, you like a smack smack? Smack smack. Smack smack. Smack smack. Smack smack. Smack Называется? Называется Синиган. Синиган. Это филиппинский суп. Да. Филиппинский. Правильно. Amazing. Amazing. I wish I could be like this one day. But right now I can говори по-русски. Говори по-русски. Джастин, говори по-русски. I speak Russian. Я могу. Я могу. I can. Mm -hmm. I can. Yeah, Magu, Gavari Marusi. Ah, хорошо. Yeah. Justin also can say like, I can eat it now and then. Yeah, yeah, always tell Justin like, try before like you you give me it, and he never tries. He just give me it like too salty or like too too dry. <laughs> I had a lot of salt already, but still don't don't have a lot of taste. I think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Give me a try. Give me a try. Yeah, you'll be a good judge. I think. think. I cook for a long time already. Mm. Let's see. Mm. Mm. You think I have more salt? Uh, I think I added quite a bit of salt because the problem about this is you don't know how much you're adding. I feel like sometimes. Mm. A little bit more. Ah, what mm. kind of salt is that? Oh, we don't know. Uh, rock, 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 rock salt. <laughs> uh, I think that's okay anyway. Anytime we can add salt, extra mm. salt. Yeah. yeah. This reminds me of uh, my mom always make asparagus. Mm. This one? Yeah. Or maybe really? you, can, you can put a small oyster sauce. Mm. I think from now on, I really just want to buy this one in the market. Now I know how it's hot, how it's hot. 
Sitao. I don't know how it's called. What, what's the name of it? Sitao. I will buy Sitao and just cook at home like this because it's really so tasty. Yeah, mm -hmm. and it's easy. Sitao. 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 It's Sounds so Chinese. Yeah, so, so Chinese. Sitao. Oh, Tao in Chinese. No, Tao in Chinese is head. Alina always said, I know, and then <laughs> wrong. <laughs> this is what? This is, this is um, something egg, eggplant. Egg yes, plant. good job. Eggplant? Mm. It looks like um, kabachok? Kabachok? You know kabachok? Mm. You guys know kabachok? Kabachok. <laughs> <laughs> Baklajan. You know now? Oh, yeah, I know, I know. In Russia, we usually eat this. Ah, but, but in Russia, Russia, yeah, but in Russia, we have baklajan, this, like, uh, but so big, like this. Uh -huh. This style. Like, yeah. a, like, like this size. <laughs> but it's so small. Just remember that in Philippines, everything is small. <laughs> <laughs> give me, give me a cup. Okay, fine. Otherwise, our audience tell, like, oh, you're gonna cook sinigan, but you, you, you don't cook. <laughs> so, how in fact? Uh, just remove this. I don't like worms. Hi, <laughs> baby. I don't like worms. <laughs> what is this? Worms. Worms. What is worms? Worms. Hey, the vegetable worms. Here. Eh? Eh? Yeah. Where? Where? <laughs> this one? Yes. It's a normal? Wait, wait, wait. Where? This one. Yeah. It's not moving, remove. Though. Just remove. Oh shit! No! Oh my god! Do we need to put it in our in our dish? No, 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 no. just remove this. I don't think it's a good idea to eat with this. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no, it's it's normal actually. Just remove it. <laughs> because actually, um, eggplant is really prone to ew. <laughs> ew. <laughs> prone to ew. <laughs> prone to ew. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, no, usually when we buy this in Russia, we never have like a warm, warm. inside. Uh -huh. yeah. mm -hmm. <laughs> so scary. <laughs> Wait, what, what? You sure? You sure you can put it in? <laughs> in soup? Yes, of course. Just remove the part. Because in other parts, it, it has no juice. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's right. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I told you. Don't eat vegetable here raw. It, it, it's not Russia like it, you you plant it in your backyard. No, it's transported in different oh my God. places. So. Oh my God. This one is okay. So. This one's okay. Yeah, I know this one. Just remove it. Yeah, the black dots. Then yeah. Though. Wow. Because I'm seeing it. So. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. So whenever I cook and then I see some some for example worms for example when I buy vegetables because it's from it's from ground, right? Mm -hmm. We cannot avoid it. They they want to eat something as well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> At least they eat nutritious food. Usually we think in Russia, if inside has like a, this one, uh -huh. which means it's bad. Uh -huh. Bad veggie, bad apple, mm -hmm. bad veggie. Do you think when we touch worm, it means it's good veggie? Mm -hmm. Because otherwise bad, the worms won't eat it. Yes, yes, that's what Ilya said as well. If, <laughs> if it's a bad, uh, if there's worm, it means it's a good veggie. Yeah, it's good veggie. Yeah. You sure? You sure? Don't have nothing. Yeah, but I don't like worms that really. Oh, I thought they just clean like a, you know, like a potato with like dots. No. Mm -hmm. so, chef, I have for you stir fry sitao with garlic and sesame oil and salt. Thank you. Thank you. Judge, ten out of ten. Leave it here. One hundred. Mm. So what I usually do, I put half of this um, powder. In, in the soup while mm -hmm. it's boiling so it will have like flavor okay, right like, 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 half only and then later Filipinos there are uh, have different ways of cooking fish okay, yes, yes, yes. okay. 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 now we put this into the soup we have oh scissors only half right yeah mm -hmm. why only half uh, because we need to boil this for maybe 30 minutes mm. and the half will be later. First time I see people smell powder. Okay, <laughs> yeah, I always try everything, right? Yes. Yeah, just mm -hmm. to have taste in 
Mm, you can smell the 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 tomatoes. Mm. Smells good already. I feel like this is like very similar. The process is very similar to many of the soup that we make uh, in Asian culture. How many soda you put? Just put everything <laughs> because it will be. Yeah. yeah, it's very similar to many soup that we make at home. For example, uh, in Russia, I know uh, Alina like like making tomato potato uh, soup. And in my Hong Kong Cantonese culture, we use tomato, potato, and pumpkin to make soup. I think Sinigang, the process at the start looks very similar as well, except for the, the tumorang that you're gonna add in there. Yeah, I think tumorang is the most hard part if we use like a normal tamarind. Mm, yeah, tam tamarind, tamarind, tum tumarind. tumarind. And also, if you're in another country, I don't think you can find tamarind. Russia, I think you can. In, in Thailand. It's coming, yeah. yeah right. In Thailand, I've seen it. Mm. Oh, the, yeah, they use uh, turmeric for some try, dishes. Try? Yeah, try the taste. Try yeah. the taste. Okay, after this, we will cook Sinigang at home always. Okay, try Sinigang. It's almost almost ready? Not yet. Not yet. I think it's still. Mm. You know? Sinigang! So sour? Yeah, love it! <laughs> hmm? Try it. Ooh, so sour! <laughs> Since we have left over, we can use it as torpan talong. Yeah, like, we need to grill it, remove the skin, and then put oil, and then fry it. Oh, tortam talong. Yeah, torta. Tortam, tortam talong. Talong. Talong is uh, eggplant in Tagalog. Oh. Yes. It's a dish called, or the name of dish? Yes. Right? Name of dish. Oh, okay. Sounds uh, good. Do you have egg? egg? Yes, yeah. many. Yeah, uh, but the problem is we cannot grill it. Uh, yeah, we don't have oven. Ah, it's in oven. We cannot do it, it's right. Ah, uh, where is, do you have? Ah, yeah, we don't have oven. Yeah, the worm is having a good time, I think. <laughs> <laughs> This is for few days, few days, not for one day. Yeah, it's okay. A, it's okay. Yeah. yeah, it should be okay. Yeah. See, so big for few days. Yeah. Eat more rice. Uh, le, le, I we'll see, yeah, we'll see. Yeah. All right. So I now we have enough space inside. Yeah, it, it should. It will shrink. Yeah. Okay. Now we add the the King Kong. Yes. King Kong. Yes, King Kong. Yes. King Kong. <laughs> okay. Mm. Ready. Okay, our Sinigang is already ready. Let's see how it looks like. Mm -hmm. Great. Yeah. Open. Tada! Wow, looks so good. Yes, and all the ingredients are underneath because we added the veggie at last. Mm. You can see the reddish, uh, the, the taro, the gabi, and the pork belly, and the tomato. Mm, all yeah. the essence is already in the soup. How it tastes. So okay, funny. guys, tell us in comments how what you think about this sinigang. Mm, it smells sour already. I can smell it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. we're so hungry, so let's start eat and try this. It's okay. amazing sinigang. Yes. All right. Let's do it. Okay. Looks so good. So this is how Filipinos eat rice. Okay, mm -hmm. he, with soup here. And then you put rice here, and then you have soup here. Oh, so separate? Yeah, separate. You need another something? Or? I think this one. Okay. I think we can take big one. Big one? This one? Big spoon, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Let's use this one. It will be easier, I think. Alright. You do here like this. Mm -hmm. Oh, so you don't add the rice inside yeah, the soup? Yeah, we don't, we don't add the rice. <laughs> we we, we put the, the dish over the rice. Do you drink soup like all? all yeah, that? not like this, only this. Ah, so you don't drink full like? 
No. No? Oh, no. you didn't drink the soup? Oh my god, oh. we always like eat full. Yeah. And that's it, and then eat with rice, mm. with vegetables, with oh. meat. Oh, oh my god, we didn't know something. Ah, so, so what you did here is like, you put, um, you put the soup and then you put the soup. Yeah, you just put rice and eat like this and drink all soup. So ah. for us, like soup is the like main. Yeah, soup is the main. Ah, yeah, yeah, because... Leah told me as well that the soup is the main dish yeah. for us. <laughs> main dish. And this sauce is how you use it. Ah yeah, okay. Wait. Uh, get some rice in your plate, mm -hmm. and then this is in that looks more creamy. Yeah, because of the taro. Yeah, take it for now. Uh, take it for now. Uh, how do you use this sauce? So for, for me, for example, the, the sinigang is not so salty, I will put some sauce here. Mm, I see. Right. Uh, so if, if there is not enough flavor and you want yeah. a bit of extra kick, then you want to add the uh, fish sauce with chili inside. Okay, that's in try. Okay. So I get veggie first, I think. I saw the steps just now. Put it underneath. Yeah. How's the sneak game? Good. Good. All right. Mm, Make this tender. <laughs> okay. Good. All right, and add all the onion, onion ingredients, and we don't add the rice in salco. Yeah. Okay. But because we don't have plates, so we're just gonna add the rice inside. No, like how about this though? Maybe we can use this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. I really want to try the yeah, because you can put the string beans in another plate because what you need to highlight the the, the rice and the soup. Mm. It's okay, it's like that. Mm. The meat is very tender. Mmm, it feels good. Mm. It's really like, you can feel the meat. Yeah. Not just like a belly. Okay, and feel meat and belly. Mm. So, I'm gonna put some rice here. Eat it the right way. Put some rice here. Mm -hmm. And then, oh, this food as well. In the meat too. Thank you. Okay, so rice, we got ready. And then we'll put some soup on top. Mm-hmm. Wow, so okay. it looks mm. new style sinigang. We never try like this. It looks thicker uh, sauce so this time. Um, Traditional. Mm. Okay, with the meat. That's right, I'm sorry. Mmm. <laughs> so hot. Mm. Oh yeah. <laughs> so yummy. <laughs> That's good. It's so sour, so I like it. Um, yeah, homemade sinigang is uh, really different to um, the typical sinigang restaurant, I think. Mm -hmm. Because I think normally in restaurants, sinigang is more watery, I think, compared to this one. To make, to make it's a bit thicker. Yeah, it looks like more creamy. Mm. It's, why it's like this? Some like ingredients? No, because of taro. I think so, yeah, I was going to mm -hmm. say. Taro. Sorry. Even just now when I wash taro, my hands feels a bit like already creamy. Mm. Um, Ooh, so yeah. Interesting. Okay. Okay. I wanna taste this. Is similar. You need to eat it with soup. This. Mm. I really love sour taste. Maybe I just need to buy this powder and cook every day. <laughs> <laughs> just powder. Mmm. <laughs> so good. So good. Mm -hmm. Joy, you good job. You are best chef. Uh, <laughs> Alicia, <yeah. laughs> super. Alicia, 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 great, great. Yeah, masala. Thank good you. job. <laughs> masala, <laughs> yes. So, so delicious. <laughs> okay, so now we'll begin eating. So uh, we'll okay, see guys. you guys in a bit. Thank you for this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Make sure you put like and some comments. And see you guys in another video. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye.